The Three Stooges are eating down there. And I just wanted to share this with you. You can see the Brumbies, two of the Brumbies there in the background. It is just so beautiful. This is the, getting on to the evening. I actually don't even know what time it is. Um, we're heading into the very end of summer and we're gonna be, I've got horses over there I can't see. Somewhere over there on that side of the creek. I've split that into two paddocks. I've got a lot more room. Hmm, Arthur just got kicked off his bucket. Well, that is not good. That is not good. I don't know, I'll keep an eye on that if. Hmm. I might have to give him some more feed. Hmm. I'm actually thinking of putting Cleo across into another paddock, like the one next to her, but it's just that, oh, that's Cleo. Oh, so Cleo's come down taking pennies and Penny's come and kicked him off. I see. Oh, goodness gracious me. I will move her tomorrow into this paddock. You see, we've got, we own all this ridge up there into the distance and all the way along here. And up here, and it goes quite a long way away. And it's actually got some good grazing and watering and, but we've got a fence. Part of, actually, a lot of it is fenced, but we need to check the fences. And then the Brumbies can go in there and the older ones can come down here and share these, like they're down here. But we can um, maybe put Cleo with <sighs> Ruby. She needs a mate, but I think I need to see. Look at him, he's got nothing to eat. I'm gonna have to go and get him some more food. Very annoying. Okay, I'll leave it at that. It totally spoiled the ambiance of our drizzling, misty evening.